Kevin Kwan is the international best-selling author behind Crazy Rich Asians. And as you know, that book was turned into a movie back in 2018. It became an instant sensation. Yeah, now his highly anticipated new novel, it drops tomorrow. Mm -hmm. It's called Lies and Weddings. It's a steamy story about a future Earl who has to decide whether to marry strategically and save his family's wealth and social standing or confess his love to his childhood best friend. Kevin, this is the book of the summer. Shall we <laughs> say you. it? Yes. What is, it's been so much fun to get to watch this ride of mm -hmm. yours. It's been mm -hmm. 11 years since Hard to you, imagine. I mean, how? Shocking. And you just told us that this, it all happened accidentally. Completely by accident. Mm -hmm. I was never meant to ever want to publish this book. I was writing it for myself from yeah. the heart and thought I would give three copies to my best friends and call it a day, you know? But you ended up kind of changing the landscape. It was like something that you wrote for yourself ended up changing everything. When did you realize the impact that the book and the, ultimately the movie had on culture? You know, I think probably the first real screening that I went oh. to. Um, I sneaked into Union Square, one of those AMC <laughs> yeah, theaters, yeah. and just to see the audience in tears, oh. right, and cheering. And I was like, <laughs> and they don't even, this is not even a Marvel movie. They don't know, know these people, and yet they are loving it so much and connecting so much. It's, what did that tell yeah. you about people? You know, we all want to connect, yeah. ultimately. Yeah. We're all the same. We all have the same problems. You know, rich, poor, doesn't really matter. Mm -hmm. And we all want joy in our lives. Mm -hmm. So Crazy Rich Asians is now turning into a musical. Hello. Which we're Can you believe that? So can't we're even dying. imagine. With yeah. John Chu, oh you know, oh, once again, wow. going to be directing it. So And, and y'all are doing kind of a casting call, which is what happened with the film that really exactly. changed, as Hoda said, yeah. the landscape. I mean, changed so many actors' lives. So what, have you started that yeah, process yet? So who's yet? it going to be? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My lips are sealed, but, you know, it's early days yet. But we, we really plan to go out there and look at amazing talent around the world because there's so much talent. Yes. Yeah, some we've Just never heard really of. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. And so we hope there'll be breakout stars we hope they'll be amazing you know okay let's talk we have to talk about this about book. your book okay. yeah it's juicy and perfect <laughs> for the summer tell us about how it came to you I mean I just you know quite frankly I love Bridgerton I wanted oh, yeah. to do the, a 21st century Bridgerton with a fun twist on it you know where I'm confounding the narrative of how you usually it's a girl always has to marry a rich guy yeah this time I'm flipping that yes. it's the guy who's desperate for the girl Oh and the girl has the money. I already like it. Don't you we love, love it? That? Yeah. And it's all told around destination weddings around the world. And who doesn't love that? Yes, oh my gosh, so I know. It's going to be so good. Wedding. I mean, I can't wait to see it on Our screen. producer said she couldn't stop reading. To, you know, she had to read through. The producer she was just telling this. me. Yeah. Yeah. She was like, all I've got night, one chapter all left. All oh, night flashlight. Mm -hmm. um, okay, you also have some recommendations yep. of books that you love by different authors. So will you give us some I, I sure do. I mean, the first one, The Piano Teacher, to me, is one of my favorite books. It's by Janice Y.K. Lee. And it's a historical romance set in Hong Kong during World War II. And just the way she evokes Hong Kong in that era, the glamour, the romance, mm -hmm. you know, it was this beautiful exotic port of call, but also the tragedy of what happened during the war there, mm -hmm. the Japanese occupation. So it's gripping, okay. gripping, okay. And, and, you know, total oh, thank epic. You. That. Thank you very thank much. Thank you. And then, of course, next we have oh. the great Amy Tan, you know, one of my yes. favorite authors yes. as well. Who did the Joy Luck Club yes. and, and the Backyard Bird Chronicles? It's she, you know, back in 2016 began sketching birds. Oh, you know, she was staying home more because she was seeing that the landscape was changing yeah. and there was sort of, you know, discrimination against Asians yeah. this and that. So she's like, you know what? I'm going to retreat to nature and begin, you know, drawing these beautiful drawings of birds. And it led to a whole book of essays and short stories about Beautiful. discovering nature and Gosh, connecting cool with birds and also really coming into her own as an amazing artist. Are these you her? Know, these are her drawings. Wait, what? what? How can so many people I know. have, have so much that? talent? Yeah. And you know, she's a rock star too, right? So yes. <laughs> she's in a band. She, Wait, what? She, I didn't know that. <laughs> she writes incredible books. She does Wait, beautiful look at drawings. I mean, the drawings are incredible. Do That's you have secret crazy. talents like this that we I wish. don't know? <laughs> I wish. No, I cannot draw like that. But oh my gosh, like really? Wow. Wow. Gorgeous. Yeah. Um, Gorgeous. Okay, tell us about this one. This one comes out later this summer, and this is one of the most fun books I've read in a long time. Deaf in the Air. It's basically Agatha Christie meets Crazy Rich Asians. Wait, what? That combo is say. crazy. It's a murder mystery set at a luxury spa in, in India. Oh my okay, gosh. That sounds Rich really Indians. good. Who's this author? Who done it? Ram Morale. It's his first book. 
Oh, wow. I know. I'm like, wait, where was this when Hello? I needed it? It yeah. sounds You'll great. Hopefully be hearing a lot more about it later this summer. Oh, my wow. gosh. Well, we're hearing a lot about yours, and it publishes tomorrow. Yeah. We know that people are going to go crazy. You're doing so much incredible work. We're so happy to have had you here. Thank you, Thank Kevin. You. We it's great to be here. And y'all, pre-order right yeah. now or you go, go, get go. It tomorrow. first thing tomorrow morning. Yeah. But if you want to pre-order it, go ahead. Kevin's new book, Lies and Weddings, it's out tomorrow. And check out his book recommendations at today.com slash books. All right, we'll be back right after this. Thank so much you, fun. Thank you. 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 Thank you.